See my finger right here? Follow my fingertip with your eyes, eyes only. Don't move your head. Alcohol should be consumed responsibly. No one should ever decide to operate a vehicle while under the influence. But what happens when people think the rules of nature don't apply to them? All right, and then put your hands behind your back. Oh, he doesn't have a hand something. From someone from the son of a state official to a university student, here are some incidents where law enforcement had to get involved to apprehend these intoxicated drivers. But look, the reason like I also lied is because my mom's a state official, and like I don't want her to get in trouble because of like some mistakes I'm making. The incident revolves around the son of a state official. On 2023, in New Mexico, an officer noticed a vehicle involved in overspeeding and not maintaining its lane. The officer pulled over the vehicle and initiated a traffic stop. The officer ordered him to step out of the vehicle and investigated him. The man claimed he was not drinking that night and agreed to perform the field sobriety tests. He explained the reason behind his overspeeding was his girlfriend, who was giving him a hard time. Yeah, you go to face me, okay? So I'm gonna have a, a DWI officer come and administer standardized field sobriety tests, okay? Like I said, based on your driving behavior, or what I've seen, okay, as well as the odor of alcoholic okay, beverage emitting from your breath, as you know, well as your sir, eyes are bloodshot and watery, so you okay? Know, sir, I'm not gonna like stand here and like lie to you anymore. Yes, okay, yeah, I, I mean, well, honest, honest, I he's important, been, right? Okay, that's very, very I've important. Been, I've been, I've been messing up in my life, man. Like. I hate that this is what it's been coming to, bro. Okay. How much have you had to drink? I don't know, man. I really Just don't. Just be honest, man. Okay. Dude, I don't know. What time did you start drinking? I don't even know, man. Okay. You don't. You don't. No. You don't remember what you drink. I'm just gonna pat you down, brother, real quick. No, okay. Right. Uh, go ahead and face my car for me. Go ahead. Just put your hands behind your back. You're not under arrest. Just put your hands behind your back. I'm just gonna pat you down. Okay. Uh, Do you have any weapons on you? No. What's in that? What's that? Oh, I honestly, oh, it's my vape. Your vape? Yeah. Okay. But honestly, sir, like. Got to pat you down, okay? No. I. You can keep your hands in your pockets now, all right? But as a, I can't <clears throat> keep lying to you, sir. I respect everything you do. You can relax, brother. Yeah, but okay. like, I can't keep lying to you. I've, I f up. Okay. I really f so, you don't remember what you drank? To be honest with I me, man. I drank some 99s, bro. How many of those did you drink? Like three or four. Three or four? How long ago? I don't know, man. I really don't you, know. I'm sorry. No, if you had to estimate what you have or what time. I don't know, man. No? Okay. So you have about three or four 99s? Yeah. Okay. I'm sorry for lying to you, sir. No, I, I appreciate you being honest with me, man, okay? That's, it's not, honesty it's, is important. No, because, like, I understand how much of a hard job you are doing. And, like, there's no reason for me to lie. But like, the reason, like, I also lied is because... My mom's a state official, and like I don't want her to get in trouble because of like some mistakes I'm making. That's your mom's name. Okay. Is she an elected official? No, she works with the state commission, literally like down the road. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Like I, I'm sorry. Like there's no reason to like have a DWI check. I'm drunk. I'm admitting to you that I'm drunk, and I shouldn't have been doing that. Okay. So do what you gotta do. Okay. Well, we still got to perform standardized field sobriety tests, okay? okay. So, uh, officer, uh, I understand. This DWI right. officer is going to have you, uh, uh anything you need perform to some tests, okay? Anything you need to do. All right. Upon confrontation, he apologized and admitted to drinking. The officer searched him and then detained him. The man then decides to come clean because his mom is a state official and he doesn't want this to come back to her. During the contact, the officers noticed his eyes were bloodshot and watery, and his breath smelled like alcohol. He informed the man that he would be conducting field sobriety tests. The officer asked him if he had any injuries or medical issues. All right, cool. We'll use this little white line right here. Just coming out of the way over here. You have any issues with your legs? No, sir. No? You don't have no issues walking, turning, or balancing? No, sir. No? Would you consider yourself pretty healthy? Yeah, so <laughs> I have a pretty shitty diet, but... Yeah, oh, okay. Yeah, I do too, but, but I mean... <laughs> but okay. you're an officer. <laughs> no, I mean, yeah. but I still got to stay healthy, you know? Yes, sir. All right. But you, you say that you could walk, turn, and balance? Yes. Okay. All right. I will try. Uh, I am not going to I'm not going to admit to anything that like I don't think I can. Okay. All right. So I'm, I'm going to give you a set of instructions and then I'm going to demonstrate it and then uh, just and then I'll tell you when to begin. But let me just tell my dispatch. No, no, it's just under here. Sorry. Sorry. Whenever you're ready. One. Two. 
Seven, eight, nine. All right, yeah. just take a step to your left, just so we're off that little line. All right, cool. So just put your feet together. All right, perfect. So. All right, going to stop. All right, Mr. Yeah. All right, let's just walk right back over here, man. Yes. All right, no one else in the car, right? Okay, all right, all right, cool. Just see that little light right there? All right. Move your wrist a little. There you go. Oh, you're good, man. Show it's a little more comfortable for you. All right. All right. So at this point, you're going to be under arrest for DWI, driving on the phone, some intoxicating liquor and or drugs. Just look at me real quick. Open your mouth. Nothing in there? No, sir. Like, lift up your tongue? All right. Nothing in there? No, sir. So on my watch, 222. All right. You have nothing on you? No, sir. All right. Let me just pat you down real no, quick. Go ahead. Just face that way. Pat him down. There is okay. a there is a weapon in my car. Just okay. Letting you know. Is it a like a firearm? It's, a, it's like a hunting knife. Oh, but not a, no firearms. No. no sir. Okay. You have anything in the vehicle that you need, like a cell phone, wallet? Uh, I think. Do you have my uh my cell phone's in my right pocket if it's in there? Okay, we'll check uh, it out. My wallet's back here. I'm so sorry. For that. Is this like a vape? Oh yeah. Oh yes. Uh, did, did you grab my phone, sir? Uh, just making sure. I think. I think. I, yeah. That's just make sure I can like call my mom. I don't know her oh, actual number. Phone, <laughs> um, just the keys. Keys stay with the keys. Oh no. Yeah, whatever. Whatever you guys you want. Just get your phone in. Yes, sir. Okay. Do I have, you have a wallet? Huh? Sir, you have everything. All right, we'll go back right back over here. Put your wallet Uh, he had this, sir. Get uh, the ID. Yeah, throw that at the, no, I don't have a wallet. I'll just get your phone, okay? Okay. Can I hit the vape for okay. uh, No, we, we can't hit that. That's not good. The officer started the first test, which was the horizontal gaze nystagmus test. In a walk and turn test, he was struggling to walk in a straight line. He was unable to maintain his balance during the one leg stand test. After failing FSTs, he was arrested and placed in the police vehicle. He revealed that failed the drug test and was blacklisted from the Air Force. At the jail, he submitted his breath sample and blew 0.16, twice the legal limit on the breathalyzer. He was charged with DWI. While the driver tried to save his mother from embarrassment, our next individual had no such issues as the only person he embarrassed was himself. Put your heels together, hands on your sides. Next test called the one leg stand. An intoxicated man named Martinez takes the center stage for our next incident. In August 2023, in Albuquerque, New Mexico, officers observed a vehicle traveling at a high rate of speed with no lights on. When the first officer pulled over the vehicle, he detected the odor of alcohol. When the suspect stepped out, the officer noticed an open container and later found a two-day-old marijuana. When SGT Lafave showed up at the scene to conduct a field sobriety test, the driver identified himself as a former corrections officer and told officers he only had one drink. The suspect was unable to defend why he smelled like liquor. Any kind of traumatic brain injury? See my finger right here? Follow my fingertip with your eyes, eyes only. Don't move your head. This finger's gonna move from your left to your right. It's fault the whole time.
Hey, same thing, I'm going up and down now. So you made it all the way from, from Santa Fe to here without your lights on? I can turn the cam to have automatic lights on it. But I mean, that's a far way to go. I mean, like, were you around other cars? Yeah. Okay. Uh, just in traffic. Gotcha. Any problems walking, bouncing, or turning? No, sir. Okay, so we got two more quick tests of to get you on your way. Can you walk right in those boots? Sure. Okay, come over with me. Next up would be step number one. Go and begin. What's up? What's up? Three. I said keep your front foot planted, turn with your back foot. Game pop return. Hands. Offline. Five. Six. Seven. Okay. Do your favorite. Right down my light. Right stand on my light. Stand on my light. Right there. Just stand on it and turn and face me. Put your heel and toes together, hands on your sides. Next test called the one leg stand. Keep counting, I didn't say stop. Take one step. Mr. Martinez, remember I told you to, to look down at your foot? Yes, sir. But you're looking over there? You mentioned that, you mentioned that it was it was windy. It's, it's, it's a little breezy. Do you think you didn't do very very well because, because of the wind? Or because of the breeze? Sir, it's your de determination. Well, no. Deeper. Correct. But, I mean, I don't know. I don't know if you think it may be because you want to mention it was, it was windy. It's breezy, but it's not wet. I don't think it's windy, but that that's just semantics. You know, you might think it's windy. I, I might think it's breezy, or vice versa. But yeah, I'm, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't think you did very well on these tests. I'm trying to ask you: Do you think it's because it was, it's breezy or windy? I feel it had some effect, but okay. Do you know the alphabet? Yes, sir. Can you count backwards? Yes? Yes, sir. Did you go to high school? Yes, sir. College? Some. Some college, okay. Starting with the letter H, stopping with the letter R. We your alphabet forward. Don't sing them, but say each letter clearly so I can hear you. H I J K L M N E Q R. Okay. Count backwards from the number 58 to 43. 58 to 43? Mm -hmm. 58. 57, 56, 55, 54, 53, 52, 51, 50, 49, 48, 47, 46, 45, 44, 43. Okay, so obviously that, that part you understood, right? Okay, walk straight in front of my police car. Just, just walk normal. The officer first conducted the horizontal gaze nystagmus test. Martinez lacked smooth pursuit in both eyes. Next, the officer demonstrated the walk and turn test. He performed it inefficiently. During the one leg stand, Mr. Martinez lacked balance and counted the digits incorrectly. The officer asked him to recite letters from H to R and numbers backward from 58 to 43. During the numbers, he said 38 instead of 48. The driver failed the test and was placed under arrest. He agreed to submit his breath test and was transported to the county jail. His BAC was 0 0.10. He was charged with DWI. While Martinez put his own life on the line by overspeeding, our next individual was caught before she could escalate the situation with her driving. All right, and then put transponder back. Oh, he doesn't have a hand on me. Yep. The incident is centered around a Floridian woman. On December 25th, 
2022 in Sarasota, Florida, Officer Michael initiated a traffic stop due to erratic driving behavior. The vehicle was accelerating and decelerating. The driver was also failing to maintain its lane. The officer approached the vehicle and confronted the driver. The officer clearly smelled the odor of alcohol coming from the vehicle and asked her to show her registration, insurance, and other documents. Hey, miss. Yes, I'm gonna have you step off me and my partner, okay? Yeah. And then passenger, if you could just stay in the car, okay? Of course. Okay, so we just wanna verify that the odor of alcohol isn't coming off of you, okay? So we're just gonna have you come up on the sidewalk here. And I just gotta ask you to do a few field sprite tests to make sure you're okay to be driving, okay? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Can, you, can you stand right here? Yeah. Right there. Where was the light is? Yep, yeah. and then face me. Okay, do you have any head, brain, or eye injuries at all? No, sir. Okay, do you take medications for anything? No, sir. Okay. Um, do you have any head, brain, or eye injuries? Like you said the first time, no, sir. Okay, how about uh, contacts or glasses? No, sir. Okay, all I need you to do is put your feet and toes together like this, hands right tight against your side, mm -hmm. hands tight against your side, mm -hmm. and follow the tip of this pen with your eyes and your eyes only. Don't move your head. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. Okay. Up here. Wait, the, nope. this or this? The okay. tip of the pen, right there. Jumping the gun, leaving the pen. So just follow the pen, okay? Don't move your oh, head. Sorry. Don't okay. move. Don't move your head. Okay, the pen's way over here. I know, and I'm looking over there. No, you were staring away over there. Mm -hmm. There you go. tip of the pen's up here. There you go. Oh, I didn't know I was looking at the tip. I was just looking at the body of the pen. I'm sorry. So tip of the pen. Go ahead and lower your chin a little bit. There you go. Follow the tip of the pen with your eyes and your eyes only. Don't move your head, please. It is cold, yep, I know. I'm out here in a t-shirt, trust me. And then up. You have to come up from her on Without moving my head correctly. Yep, 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 you're doing fine. You're following, following the directions well. The officer asked her to step out of the vehicle and conducted field sobriety exercises. The officer ensured if she had any injuries and started the horizontal gaze nystagmus test. She was moving her head and lacked smooth pursuit in both eyes. The officer again and again asked her about how much she had been drinking, but she refused to admit it. Okay. Hands tight against your side. Begin when you're ready. Okay. Look at your One, feet. Look at your feet. Two. Oh, f okay. Hands tight against your side. One, Look at your feet. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, oh, nine. Small step up series to the back. Hands tight against your side. Tight against my side. Staring at your feet. Left or right first, sir? As I instructed. Left first. One, two. Hands tight against your side for the fifth three, time. Four. Five, six, seven, nine. Okay, just like that. All right, and then put your hands behind your back. Oh, he doesn't have a hand Yep. Okay. okay, you're under arrest for DUI, okay? Okay. okay.
Yeah, I agree. Your driving was pretty crazy. Um, we'll have you go right over here, okay? Um, he's going to have to call for a ride or something, okay? 6206 dispatch. I have one female 1015. I have a female 51 in my location for a search. You don't need to raise your hand. You can just leave. Yep, I see you. Hey, sir. Uh, your friend is going to jail for DUI. Do you want to go ahead and call for a ride? I have, I have a friend. My mom. My mom or, or, or another friend or something right now. They are? Yeah. Okay. Um, you don't have to stay in the car. Um, I'm probably going to move it and park it, so you're free to leave if you want to just wait in the park. Or... Is, there, is, there, is there a way that if my mom came here and drove her car home to help her out in the long run? Or you have to take the car? Well, your mom can only drive one car. <laughs> no, that's what I'm saying. My mom bring, bring her car home for her. This is a good friend who was trying to help me out. I didn't know. I mean, I'm just going to park her car for her. Oh. I so, have a so you're right yeah you're free to you, you can go wait on the bench or whatever okay okay you're free to go sir yep when she was done performing the walk and turn test the officer arrested her for DUI the passenger was told to get a ride it was decided to park her car instead of getting it impounded the female officer arrived to conduct a search of the woman and then placed in a police cruiser she was charged with DUI. While the woman's intoxicated status was instantly obvious due to the odor of alcohol, our next individual had to be caught after several sobriety tests. No, you're, you're good. It was just nine steps there, nine steps oh, back. All right. This incident involves an inebriated driver named Gavin Green. On October 20th, 2023 in Flagler County, Florida, an officer noticed a vehicle was overspeeding. The officer initiated a traffic stop. Upon contact, Gavin claimed he was driving 30 miles per hour and told the officer that he was not hostile. Also, according to him, he had not been drinking for 24 hours. Based on the indications of impairment, including his eyes being watery and the odor of alcohol emanating from him, the officer conducted the field sobriety exercises. Gavin told the officer he wore glasses when it was dark. Take a second to blink, okay? Relax your eyes. We're gonna do one more, okay? This time we're just gonna go up and down, all right? Yeah, up and down. You're, you're good. It was just nine steps here, nine steps okay. back. All right. One second. Right. 
What um, what way did you use to count in your your head? Like, how did you count? I just counted the normal amount I think a second would go. So you know. So one, like how? Okay, so two. Just by like one, it wasn't like one Mississippi, two Mississippi, nothing no, like that. No, no, no. I just counted a normal amount of seconds. You know, I was in ROTC and stuff, so I got a good kind of count on time. So. I got you. Okay. Left, right, left, right, right, left. The first test was a horizontal gaze nystagmus. He was asked to blink for a second. During the walk and turn test, he took the wrong number of steps. He didn't count out loud while performing the one leg stand. Next, the officer asked him to estimate the passage of 20 seconds, and he clearly estimated more than 20 seconds. Lastly, the officer asked him to perform the finger to nose test. Eventually, due to failure of the test, he was placed under arrest. On their way to the police vehicle, he claimed he passed all the tests. He was charged with DUI. While Gavin was apprehended due to his failure to do the tests properly, our next individual's inebriated status was obvious when he decided to drive on the wrong side of the road. So once we get that figured out, make sure you're able to drive. Yeah. Like I said, you told me you had a couple drinks, I just wanna make sure you're able to drive. Yeah. The last incident is centered around a 22-year-old university student. On April 14th, 2023, Rowan University police officers stopped a Mercedes-Benz for driving the wrong way on a one-way street. The officer approached the vehicle and asked the driver to show the documents of the vehicle. The registration he provided was expired. When the officer asked him how much he had been drinking, he replied with not much. A couple field sobriety tests. Cool. Um, wait for my sergeant to get here. We'll do that, all right? Uh, um, you don't have anything up to date on this stuff? Not even like on your phone or anything? No. Right here. That's uh May of twenty one. It expires, sorry. Nothing else? No, I don't. I have a deal for you anyway. Just do me a favor. Um, for, uh, yeah, I mean, if you've been drinking, I don't want you to I had two drinks. drive a car. I had two drinks. I'm not drunk at all. Can I pull over somewhere? Uh, like I said, hang on until I just don't. I want to make sure I want to check you out first. Mm -hmm. Make sure you're good to drive, and then we'll go Radio from there. All right, FaceTime video. All right. Uh, so once we get that figured out, make sure you're able to drive. Yeah. Like I said, you told me you had a couple drinks. I just want to make sure you're able to drive. Yeah. All right. Um, I don't want to have you move the vehicle and I got you. something happen. All right. So, just uh, your car's a park, right? Mm -hmm. Just step out for me real quick. Just over here. So we got a couple drinks. Um, hey, man. It's warm. It's fine. A little bit. Not much. All right. So I'm going to do a test of your eyes, all right? Mm -hmm. So during this test, I'm going to need your hands out of your pockets. All right? Just keep, have your feet together, like I'm demonstrating right here. Mm -hmm. Hands down by your side. Okay. Have you had any uh, alcohol tonight? You said a couple drinks. Two drinks, yeah. Okay, two drinks. Hard drinks, beers. Box of pineapples. Okay. All right. Any uh, marijuana or anything? No. Drugs or anything? Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a test of your eyes. All right. 
Anything I need to know about? Any head injuries, eye injuries, no, anything no, like no. that? No, nothing? Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move this pen left to right, okay? When I move this pen, I don't want you to move your head at all. Yes, sir. Just your eyes and your eyes only. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Okay. You see the tip of the pen? Yes, sir. Okay. Open your eyes for me. So I'm gonna have you step up here to this mm -hmm. side of the sidewalk just because it's a little more yeah, yeah, straight. I'm gonna run you through a couple tests, all right? Mm -hmm. So the first one, it's gonna be the walk and turn. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm gonna have you come to the start position. You're gonna have your feet together. Place the foot if you're choosing, left or right, in front of the other, like so, okay? Then you're gonna put your hands by your side and hold that position until I finish the instructions, all right? Mm -hmm. So take your left foot or your right foot, place it in front of the other, like so. Now I'm gonna say begin. At that point, you're going to take nine heel to toe steps. I'm going to take three. You're going to take nine. It's going to look like this. One, two, three, and so on until you get to nine. Yes, when you get to the ninth step, you're going to walk around a couple small choppy steps, turn around, you're going to come back. Nine more. One, two, three, and so on until you get to nine. Yes, sir. Do you understand? Yes, sir. All right, please get in the starting position. Do you have any injuries by any chance? No, sir. All right. Place your right foot or your left foot in front of the other. Heel to toe like this, such as this. Mm -hmm. And then begin. Heel to toe, get touch. All right, man. So the next test, it's going to be the one-legged stand test, okay? Yes, sir. So you're going to have your feet together, hands to your side for me. When I tell you to begin, you're going to pick a leg of your choosing, mm -hmm. left or right, and you're going to raise your leg about six inches, about the size of a soda can, like mm -hmm. this. Point your toe out, look down at your toe, count 1-1001, one, 1-1002, one, 1-1003, one, 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 and so on until I tell you to stop. Uh, you understand? Yes, sir. All right, were you hurting the last test at all? No. All right, you may begin. 1001, 1002, 1003, 1004, 1005, 1006. Continue. Uh, the other one? 1002. No, 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 no. Um, I'm good. So continue until I tell you to stop. Oh, so my, I'll leave you to, to six. 1006, 1007, 1008, 1009, 1010. Keep your hands by your side. 1010, 1011. Put them straight down for me. 1011, 1012, 1013. 2014, 2015, 2016, 2017, 2018. Look down at your toe for me. Oh, sorry. 2019, 1020, 1921, 1022. Look down at your toe while you're counting. 1022, Later, the officer first conducted a horizontal gaze nystagmus and found four out of six clues. While performing the walk and turn test, he missed some heel to toe steps and turned while taking the ninth step. He stopped himself before the officer told him to during the one leg stand. He was later arrested for DUI and placed in a squad car while his friend protested. He was transported to the University Public Safety Building where he was allowed to submit to a breathalyzer. His parents showed up to pick him up at 3.30 a.m and they signed papers. He was charged with DUI, and later he was pled guilty to the DUI charge. For more interesting stories about criminals, subscribe to the channel.